Every project manager knows that it's important to learn from experience, but it's no good just writing down what happened. That's just a lesson observed, not a lesson learned. So how can you effectively record what you learned for the benefit of others? Here's my advice. Reflect on your experience and note down the most significant events that happened on the project, both favourable and unfavourable. Think about these observations and identify the underlying cause. Why did it happen? What were the circumstances? Were there any early warnings? Once you know the cause, think about what recommendation you would make to your future self or to someone else that would help to make things run more smoothly in the future. Then, turn this into a story. This could be written, delivered as a presentation, in a face-to-face -face conversation, or recorded as a video. The thing to remember is don't polish it too much and murder the message by suffocating it in layers of corporate ease. Instead, make it personal, powerful and passionate to keep it engaging. I recommend using a star format for your lesson covering these points. Firstly, the situation. So this is what we were faced with, the constraints, the risks, the issues and so on. Then, the target, which is what we wanted to achieve and the action, which is what we did. Then the result, which is the consequences of our actions. Now there's nothing new so far, I know, but here it comes. Lastly, the recommendation. This is the moral of the story. So in order to achieve better outcomes in the future, this is how we recommend that people, including us, should behave differently or how we should change the process. So that's rules, systems and so on to improve future outcomes. This could cover things to do or not to do. So if this situation applies, then do that. This is the vital so what that changes the lesson from being just an interesting anecdote to an actionable piece of advice based on real life experience. Lastly, the person learning the lesson should include some details of how they can be contacted to have a conversation in case they've left the organisation by the time the lesson is being watched or read. For some real examples of what this looks like, why not take a look at my Scary Scars Shared interview series in which real project managers share with me in around 10 minutes each what they learned from their most challenging project management experiences. For more practical tips on learning lessons from projects, why not take a look at my book, Learning Lessons from Projects? Or visit the link in the comments to download this handy resource that I've created. I know these look backwards to you, but that's because of the video app I'm using. My face is the other way around in real life too. It makes me much better looking. How do you record your learning for the benefit of others? Let me know in the comments and follow or connect for more Pragmatic PMO videos.